I'm gonna try to get Blot Man over there. Without getting Duncan ulted into next week. Got it. What is up guys and gals, Space Unicorn here, bringing you some hot frag action. So today guys, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be doing five best heavy cards. As you notice, there are five rolls. This is recommended by Anzo. In the lid, you can see the little comment up in the top left right now. Um, he recommended this. We're going to do this video. I like the idea. I'm going to do each category just like he suggested. And we're going to see, can the five best cards from each category coexist and get the win? Uh, before we get into this video, I need you guys to do me a huge favor. I need you to remember to like, comment, and subscribe on the video because your support is... I, I can't even tell you how much it actually means to me because it, just genuinely, guys, bottom of my heart, Thank you so much. That being said, let's get into the match and let's see if we can get the dub with the five best heavy cards. In my opinion, these are the five best heavy cards. We have Blot, Lucha, Frost, Hannibal, and Prisoner 99. There are several other good ones like Big Paku, Genghis, Roloff, but they don't quite eclipse any of these cards in their standing. So we're going to hop into a match and we're going to see, can we get this job done? We're going to bring you guys right back as soon as we get into the match. Alrighty, guys and gals, here we go. So, these are the five best heavy cards in the game. I apologize, I actually didn't even get in the last match. Apparently, I left immediately upon entering said match. Um, so, we're going to get in here. We're going to see if we can get the job done. Um, this lineup is going to have some good things to and going forward. It has a lot of health on the offensive push. Pretty good damage output on the defensive. So, you should be able to get some pretty decent holds going with it. Um, that's one of the things that I'm really interested in whenever I pick a lineup. I'm looking for a lineup that can really kind of hold it down on both sides of the field. There's not many cards that do that successfully. Nice thing about the defensive cards though is the defensive cards are going to allow us to they really kind of they just have the health we need to truly dish out and do the damage. At the end of the day, there's just this defensive cards have it. All right, we're on our way to the next one. Get Soldier Tron. Oh, wait, what? I must be lagging. That's the only thing I can think of right now is I've got to be lagging. Right? That's what's going on. Yeah. Huge lag spike. Oof, boys. That's an oof. Okay, that's that's really not good. The lag is going to be a problem. Oh, boy. He is... Yeah, this is going to be bad, guys. This is going to be really bad. This is extreme lag. Got him. I think Lucha should be over there right now. Where's the boat? It's Lucha. Cool. That's what we wanted. Sneak right past. It's tippy toeing right past the Blot Man. Blot Man goes up to the main tower. Never mind. I missed the turn. I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> I was a little confused there for a second. We had that huge lag spike. Um, but that's okay. We got the issue on the tower command. And we got Blot up here. You guys know Blot damage on a tower. Yeah, it's kind of a big deal. That, that, it, there's really just no other way to put it. Blot damage on a tower. <laughs> Game over. I win. GG's to that guy. Um, yeah, so I will bring you guys right back as soon as we get into our next match. Um, yeah, we'll see you momentarily. Alrighty, guys and gals. We're going into a street frag match now with the tank cards. Um, I honestly think this match is going to be pretty straightforward and simple. Um, number one, because honestly, the amount of health we're pushing through here really can kind of hold their own. Um, I said that in the last game, but like health with the meta being what it is, is so, so, so important. And there's really no workaround for it. That's the crazy thing. Oh man, dude. Frost counters Ronin. He really does. <laughs> Actually, to be fair... This is some of the best frost damage I've had in a long time coming out from this card. There's a roll off. Uh, my cards do not listen. Come here! Get over here! Should that attack come in? Oh, 
I'm honestly just walking around right now slaying. We win. Nice job to the heavy cards. Um, yeah, like I said, this, this lineup right here, honestly, I have very little concern with the heavy cards because the heavy cards are just designed in a way that they're really, they, while they, while this may not be a meta lineup, this lineup is still going to be very good and very solid across the board. Um, so we'll bring you guys back as soon as we reconnect to the server here and get into the next match, and I'll see you guys momentarily. Alrighty, guys and gals, we are back with Payload. Um, this map, so honestly, this map is kind of a toss-up. It has a lot of long sight lines, which are not going to be ideal for the heavy cards. But it kind of makes up for the long sight lines with um, with ample cover in a lot of positions in there. Unless you're on the back side, like right back here. That That's a little bit of a different animal altogether. Um, but you guys can kind of... Oof, dude. Oof, dude. Honestly, with this game... It's just these cards, man. These high-level bots on payload. It's just a different level. It really is. There's no other way to really put it. Like, the cards are just different on payload as opposed to everything else. But we're winning so far. Look at that. Frosty Boy didn't... I mean, Lucha didn't even make a dent on the tower. He just like, oh, I guess I'm supposed to attack this tower, but, uh... Yeah, <laughs> they have a level 14 Frost, a level 14 Medusa sitting over here. We're honestly just going to escalate this payload. We really are. Get him off the field. I'm going to try to get Blotman over there. Without getting Duncan ulted into next week. Got it. Oh, I thought I destroyed it. That's why I switched off. No, Pepe hands. Back to the payload. <laughs> Honestly, this lineup, we're doing all right on the defensive end, and that's a good thing. At least we have that going for us, you know? And now we got to kind of push across this field here, and we will uh, see what we can do here. we got to watch out for these guys. Get rid of that Ronin real quick. Watch out for the other one. I don't know what Blot's doing. Blot looks like, hey, look at this. This is a nice wall. That's a nice wall. Go, Blot man. You can do it. If Blot can get on that tower, dude, it'd be so big. <laughs> One shot. Eh, no, he couldn't even get the second shot off because the frost is such a high level. Oof, we won, though. We did win. We won all three matches with tanks, heavy, sorry, heavy cards only. Um, anyways, I like the suggestion, Anza. We're going to finish this series out. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please remember to like, comment, subscribe in the down there. And I will see you legends next time. And leave your ideas for videos in the down there as well. Have a great night, everybody. Bye-bye.